Hey guys, your boy Jack here. I'm back from the video. And today, if y'all cannot tell from the title of the video, we are here on Christmas Eve. Today is finally Christmas Eve. The day I uploaded this video is Christmas Eve. I don't know when you're watching this video, but the day I uploaded it is Christmas Eve. So with that being said, let's get started with today's video. So right now, the time is December 23rd, 2023, and the time is 11.23 p.m. That is when I'm filming this video right now, but the day that this video is going out is going to be December 24th, 2023. With that said though, in this video, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't really have anything planned except I'm just going to talk to you guys. I'm just gonna talk to you guys about a couple of different things, talk about the Falcons, talk about what I'm doing Christmas Eve and why I have to film this video like this. So with that said, yeah, I'm filming this video right now because yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I'm kind of, in a slump where I am kind of just rushing to make videos for Vlogmas because to be honest I did not do any preparation I did not prep for this at all and I kind of just winged it this Vlogmas so yeah y'all can definitely tell because some of my content has been pretty mid but with that said though some of my content was really good then some of them was very bad so at least I got to learn from this so let's just look on the bright side and just take it as a learning experience right but with that said though, yeah, I had a couple of different ideas that I want to do. I could have done like some like wrapping Christmas gifts, but I didn't want to show the Christmas gifts because I don't have any boxes and I just tend to do things last second. So that might be in the last video for Vlogmas, which is going to come out on December 25th, which is Christmas Day 2023. But with that said though, yeah, I'm here making this video because yeah, Christmas Eve is today, right? And the reason why I couldn't film nothing or do anything for Christmas Eve or just I don't know I guess why I'm trying to say is why I have been uh, kind of putting a lot of these videos last second is just because I've been working a lot I have been working a lot this past week alone um, basically I worked over 40 hours yeah I got overtime pay and yeah I just been uh, working a lot I have been grinding I've just been yeah Working in retail during the holidays, bro, you work a lot. And especially when a lot of people are calling out or requesting off for the holidays, yeah, you be short staffed and you just have to pick up everyone's slack and that's kind of what I've been doing. I've been I've been working a lot and I am physically and mentally tired. But that is not an excuse though because I've told myself um, going to that job that that job is going to be my side hustle. You know what I'm saying? My side hustle. And YouTube is going to be my main hustle. And basically, what I'm trying to say is, even though this vlogmas, I did not prepare as much as I needed to, um, just stay tuned for next year because I'm going to put a lot more prep and effort into next year's vlogmas, which is a year away, but also just in my videos in general, as that's something I want to do and basically just better my content. You know what I'm saying? So, I guess basically what I'm trying to say is just that stay tuned. I'm going to not be putting up some half ass videos i'm gonna put some time into my videos put some effort and just kind of make better quality videos and i know i've been saying that for a long time but i just wanted to re say it because yeah there's probably a lot of new people to my channel or a lot of people returning um but yeah i just want to stay tuned for that but with that said though the reason why i am not able to do anything on christmas eve is because i am working christmas eve which is December 24th, 2023, is on a Sunday. And yeah, I have to work. My shift tomorrow is a 10 to 7. So yeah, I'll still have some time after work. But after work, I have to go grab some things, such as like cooking stuff so I can cook for my family. Uh, breakfast, you know what I'm saying? Gotta keep my tradition alive that my sister started where she cooks breakfast to us. I have to do it this year because she is out of town. Um, so yeah, I gotta do that. Basically what I'm trying to say is Christmas Eve for me is gonna be a busy, busy day. So the day I upload this video is going to be a busy day for me, which I will probably vlog a little bit of it. I don't know, we'll see. Um, so stay tuned for that, you know what I'm saying? Just stay tuned for the last video for Vlogmas, which is going to be December 25th. 2023 and with that said the day this video goes out which is a sunday you know what i'm saying christmas eve this year that we got football and i'm a falcons fan and we are playing the indianapolis colts at home our last home game originally i wanted to get the day off so i can go to this last falcons home game but i couldn't so it's okay but in reality, I'm hoping we lose to the Colts. I hope we lose to the Bears. I hope we lose to the Saints. I hope we finish the season 0-3. Um, 
And I hope we finish the season, like, I think we're at six wins right now. I hope we finish the season six and 11. The reason I say that is because I want Arthur Smith out of here, bro. Arthur Smith is not a good head coach. I want him out of here. And honestly, we bring in a good offensive coordinator. And that's all we're going to need for real. Because I think we have a good head coach in our defensive coordinator that we brought in from the Saints last year. And basically, we promote him to the head coach because he made our defense a top 10 defense. And then all we got to do is just bring in an offensive coordinator that could set our offense straight. And with our pick this year, we draft a receiver or someone else to help Desmond Ritter. Because I don't think we should take another quarterback unless we can get someone for a very, very cheap deal. So, basically, if we can't get Justin Fields for like a third, fourth round pick, I don't want him. And if we don't get like Michael Pinnex in like the third round, I don't want him. Basically, I'm saying is that I don't want to not waste a pick because it's not a waste of a pick, but it's just I'd rather fill up the positions that we more desperately need because we need a number two receiver. You know what I'm saying? We need someone to help out Drake London. And basically, I would not be mad at another receiver. The reason why I say that is because then we have completed an offense around Desmond Ritter. And if Desmond Ritter cannot perform with the offense that we give him, then it's on him, and that's when we get to move on and get a better quarterback. But for now, I still think we give Desmond Ritter a chance. I might be dick riding Desmond Ritter, but I still feel like Desmond Ritter deserves a chance. But enough about the Falcons, because I know I can ramble and talk about my Falcons all day. But I know for sure next season, I want to go to hopefully all of the Atlanta Falcons home games and maybe even travel away to some of their games just so I can see how going to an away game feels or just the experience just because I feel like it'll be a good experience and plus I want to travel. But yeah, basically enough of that. So basically, before we finish this video off, I want to talk about two more things and basically plans going into next year and just one last more thing of talking about Christmas. So basically going into next year, I think I'm going to do the same thing what I've been doing. It's consistently upload weekly, you know what I'm saying? But not just to this channel, to my gaming channel and so on and whatever else I want to do. I just want to take my content quality to the next level and I just want to become a better content creator and have good ideas have fresh ideas have unique ideas and yeah just go from there I want to travel more so expect more travel vlogs I'm gonna try to make them as aesthetically pleasing as I possibly can and yeah just stay tuned I have a whole bunch of different ideas for the month of January and just the whole year in general but I'm only taking it day by day because I don't want to get too far ahead because then that's when I will start getting stressed, overthinking, overwhelmed. So I'm just taking what is given to me and going from there. But yeah, I'm definitely excited for next year. New Year, new me. And with that said, I'm probably going to be releasing a New Year's resolution video uh, to end this year off at least. Uh, because I have a couple goals that I want to achieve. Um, so I don't want to see them this year because I'm probably going to just save it for that video. Because honestly, that's probably going to be my last video of this year. So with that said though, after Vlogmas ends, Vlogmas ends December 25th, right? And basically, I upload every Wednesday. So that means December 27th, 2021, 2023. Uh, that is going to be my last video of the year. And basically... I'm going to take a little break and then going into the new year, you guys should be expecting some videos from me. On January 1st, you should be expecting some videos on my gaming channel. And then on January 3rd, you should be expecting a video from this main channel. So stay tuned for that. So basically, I'm probably going to take December 28th to December 31st. Just take a break. Take a little mental break because you're bored. I don't know. I'm mentally drained, mentally tired. And I just need a break. You know what I'm saying? Not saying that I'm not going to film or do anything. I'm probably going to take a break from just social media, editing, YouTube, not YouTube, Instagram, so like Snapchat. Um, yeah, I might even stop using Snapchat completely in 2024 because honestly, I don't see a point in Snapchat. I just have a Snapchat because I just be doing streaks and I don't know, I think I just outgrown Snapchat. That might just be me. Because other than streaks, I just use Snapchat because it's quicker to pull up and then record things and it's easier to record things than having to go to your camera sometimes just because it's quicker. I don't know. It just, I don't know. If you feel that it's quicker, let me know down below in the comments. If you don't think it's quicker, let me know down below in the comments. Just Let's just start an argument in the comments or something. But basically with that said though, we are probably going to just see what the new year brings us and we're just going to go from there. I might do a video where I go a month without Instagram. Who knows? Stay tuned for that. And I might do a video where I drink green juice for a week. Who knows? 
or I might do a video where I try to see who has the best boba. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned for the video ideas that I have because I have a lot of videos coming soon. So stay tuned for the good content coming next year. But enough of me rambling about all that fun stuff. Let's talk about Christmas Eve. <sighs> I already know Christmas Eve working in retail, it's going to suck. It's going to be a long, stressful, tiring day dealing with customers, dealing with the last second Christmas shoppers. It's going to be a pain in the ass, but it's, it's nothing I can do. It just is what it is, and I just gotta deal with it. With that said, I basically got all of the gifts that I need. I might need to go grab one more thing, um, just because, yeah, last second Christmas shopper. So basically, I'm talking shit about myself because I be the last second Christmas shopping. Um, but it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But with that said though, I'm excited for Christmas. I need a break. Basically, Monday, I'm just going to do nothing but chill, uh, relax watch Christmas movies, sleep, I don't know, basically just chillax, you know what I'm saying, because I need a break, like I said, mentally tired, excited to spend time with the family, eat with the family, um, yeah, can't wait to see how Christmas is, you know what I'm saying, you know, the stress of buying Christmas gift is finally basically over, I just get to enjoy the holidays, and yeah, I go from there, and with that said, I hope you guys are having a good Christmas holiday time of the year um, basically just having a good time during the holidays having time with your family you know what I'm saying just you know be thankful for the little things and just yeah life life is life and you know what I'm saying and this year just went by quick as fuck you know what I'm saying like a lot has happened this year for me and yeah we are here about to go into 2024 but we still got Christmas to finish and New Year's so yeah, we got to see what happens there. But yeah, I am excited for Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Not excited to work on Christmas Eve and run errands on Christmas Eve because there's going to be a lot of people and it's going to be very busy. But, you know, it is what it is. And that's my fault. I should have not procrastinated. But with that said, though, I don't want to ramble too much. I'm sorry that this year's Vlogmas was all over the place. Um, yeah, I apologize for that. So let me know down below in the comments, though. Let me know what you guys liked for my vlogmas this year. Let me know if you'd like the more Christmassy stuff or the other random stuff or just basically if you'd like a mix of both or you want more Christmas or you want more of this. Let me know so I know what to bring you guys next year because next year is going to be way more organized and it's going to be way more better. Way more better. Yeah, good English for me. But yeah, just stay tuned to that because I'm going to basically have a better plan next year. That's what I'm trying to say. But enough of me rambling. I don't think I have anything else left to say to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So subscribe, share, and your boy is out.